Hey guys, Jen Kua here from my Biz Breakthroughs. Welcome to this online training course. Today we will talk about how to rise your revenue and propel your profits each month, even if nobody knows who you are using your own business marketing funnel. So if you are a business owner, marketing is one of the biggest sources of disappointment and frustration because this is where you normally spend a lot of money with your ad agency, doing your billboards, TV ads, radio, social media, and the list must go on. And the marketing efforts barely produce any results. And what's even worse is you run out of budget. Wouldn't you feel less stressed and relaxed if you can always have this consistent flow of customers rushing to your door and ready to buy your product or use your services? Wouldn't it be nice if you can set up your own irresistible marketing funnel that will give you a predictable results like lead generation, sign up, or even sales conversion? If you ever talk to your ad agency, I am sure that you probably noticed that their first question to you is, how much money do you have in your marketing budget? Sounds familiar? I know this because I used to be in this position who is in charge of negotiating and discussing the marketing plans for this multi-million dollar business manufacturing company that I used to work with for 16 years. If you can pay $80,000 or $100,000 for your ad agency, I don't see any issues of the effectiveness of the suggestion that they are bringing. But the big issue here is we don't understand the big picture of what marketing is. Now, if you don't understand what marketing is, your customers won't come to you. Generating traffic is easy. You can simply generate hundred thousands of traffic to your website in less than 15 minutes using Adfly, Facebook, or Google AdWords. Provided that you have the budget that you can spend, then you can generate as much traffic as you want. Traffic is only one segment to increase your business revenue. How to convert this traffic into money is another segment. If customers don't come in, and if you cannot convert these customers into money, you'll be out of business in no time. So is this make sense? If you have never been taught about marketing, it can seem like the most daunting subject, right? Your success to rise your revenue or your income per month depends on the success of your marketing. Everyone seems to have different opinion about marketing, but here's the reality. If you want to make money, you need to sell something, whether it is an actual product, services, digital product, or even selling a clean air in a can. So it doesn't matter what kind of product you are selling. Bottom line is if people will not give you their money in exchange of whatever product or services you have, then you will be out of business. It's just obvious that we need as much eyeballs to see our offer and we need to convert this traffic into sales. So remember, if you cannot convert these people to buy what product or services you have, you cannot rise your revenue or propel your profits. So now, who is this training for? If you are a business owner spending too much money on advertising without understanding the big picture of marketing, then this is for you. Or if you are a consultant or doing this coaching program thinking that effective marketing is expensive or if you are a digital product owner software designer struggling to generate traffic and leads to your product or services or a real estate insurance broker or accountant who is struggling to find high ticket clients suited for your services then this is for you or to anyone as long as you have something a product or services that you want to exchange this for money, then you can benefit from this online training. So first, let me just give you a brief background of myself, why I am so confident to stand all behind this. My name is Jen Kua. My first job was flight attendant for seven years. After I graduated from college, this is my first job with Saudi Arabian Airlines as a flight attendant. So this is me. I used to be based in Jeddah and in New York, 
And my second job was an executive director of finance and marketing planning. I got involved in business startup in Vietnam and in Thailand for 16 years. My husband and I, we work together in this snack food manufacturing company, and we are so lucky to be part of this business startup. So when we reached Vietnam, this was totally an empty land. Then after nine years in Vietnam, we're sent to Thailand and do the same business startup again. And this is my office in Thailand. So these are my colleagues. So you see this? This is my last marketing campaign. So I have this uh, bus. This is the bus with our logo. This is the last project that I got involved selling this to 7-Eleven. My husband and I made our biggest decision in our life, quitting our job together. And this was our last photo taken during our last day of work on July 27 of 2012. By mid of 2013, I started my online business career. And this is when my biz breakthroughs was born. And I'm also the founder of Travel with Jang, product creator of the Breakthroughs Mastery course, AdWords PPC Mastery, and the ClickBank Made Easy. Now, marketing is how customers perceive you or your business, how well your website experience is designed, how prompt is your customer service, the quality of the work or services you do for your customers, and so on. Everything that affects the customer's perception of you or your business is marketing. And advertising is only one component of marketing. For example, online advertising brings customers to your website, but whether customers stay in your website or buy your product is another matter. So even if you can drive tons and tons of traffic to your site each day, but you cannot convert them, then your marketing is not successful. Here's what you will learn once you completed this online training. You will discover how to set a scalable business foundation to systematize your service so customers will keep coming back to you. Second, you will learn how to get out on your own way to build your own irresistible marketing funnel to understand each specific needs of your customers and deliver excellence every time. And third, you will discover the three different pillars of traffic, how to use them to get the best out of it, to increase your revenue and propel your business profits each month. So let me just pull out my whiteboard for you. So planning properly from the start of where you want to go is crucial to your success. So let's say you started and decided to start your business online. So this is your starting point and this is your end goal here. Okay, so let me just put here goal. Now I'm not talking about let me just change this okay, to marker. I'm not talking about a $1,000 per month goal or let's say $500 per month goal. Okay, So we are not talking about this small goal. Because if you are a business owner, if you are a truly entrepreneur, your goal per month is to increase your income at least, at least, okay, 10K per month and above. Because if you want to have a lifestyle, like you want to travel and have a grand vacation with your family twice every month, at least you must have $20,000 budget for that vacation. So that means that you need to earn more so you can be liberal on your spending and you need to multiply your income. So you are not aiming for this small goal, but instead, at least from 10 k and above. Here's the thing. If you are not willing to invest for your business, then it's difficult for you to move from where you are right now to where you want to go. This is where you want to increase and propel your income. You need money to make money. So planning properly from the start of where you want to go, how you take your first step here into things and how to make money on every step that you will make here is crucial to your success as well as your strategy or techniques on how you structure your business foundation in reaching this goal. So is this make sense? If you are an entrepreneur, there's no such thing an end destination here. Business owners continues to expand. 
they continue to grow. So if your aim is to make 1K or $500 per month, then this is not for you. Because earning 1K or 2K or 5K per month, you can earn this by working and keeping your current job. So now, why do you think I quit my full-time job and started building my own business that I can fully control? This is for entrepreneur whose target is to aim at least minimum of $10,000 per month or $50,000 per month, 100K per month, or building your million-dollar business. So now let's go back to your first outcome that you will learn from here. So you will discover how to set a scalable business foundation to systematize your service so customers will keep coming back to you. So take note of this. Set a scalable business foundation so you can systematize your service. So planning properly from the start. So let me just uh, put it here, okay? Let me write it down here. So first is you must have a proper planning from the start. So let me just make this bigger. So must have a proper planning from the start. What niche or industry that you want to get in? So you need to identify your niche. And what's your long-term value? So what is the long-term value that you can give? And your strategy, how you can make money in every step of the way, is crucial to whatever goal that you set here. So here you have the long-term value, and then you need to identify your strategies, how you can make money in every step of the way here to attain this goal. So whether you want to improve your income of $10,000 per month or $50,000 per month or $100K per month, you need to have proper planning, identify your niche, long-term value, and you must have a good strategies in place. Let me go back to my backstory here. So this is the factory that my husband and I and the whole team set up from ground up. So when we came here, this is just an empty piece of land. So you will not see this building erected and there was no even a decent road going to this area because we were the first factory erected inside this industrial park. So what do I mean set a scalable business foundation to systematize your service? So here's the good news. There's no need for you to invest millions of dollars to build this multi-million dollar facilities to run your business. So if you already have these four things, your proper planning, identify your niche, long-term value, then let me show you how you can increase your income or revenue or propel your profits each month. So first, let me just give you some idea of what kind of product that my previous company that I used to work with are selling. So let me just Google here the Oishi brand. So Oishi snack food. So if you are trying to build your own brand, then you must have your own website. So let's check the website here. So this is the website of the snack food manufacturing that I used to work with. So this is cute. So these are the products that we are selling from that multi-million dollar manufacturing facilities. So can you imagine, in order for us to make $10,000 per month profit, okay, how many boxes that we should sell if the cost of this product is less than 50 cents per piece. So can you imagine? You need to sell like 50,000 cases or more per day. So now, I do not know you and I do not know what kind of product, your price range that you want to sell. But let me just give you some numbers here and let's just reverse engineer our number. If your intention is to earn 10K per month, all you need is just focus to two up to five products inside your niche. So for example, if you are a life coach or doing this one-on-one -on -one consulting, then you can charge by the hour. Or you can just get two to three clients, but these clients are high ticket clients. So it depends on what kind of value that you are providing to your customer. Or if you want to sell a physical product, you can go to alibaba.com and you can find different suppliers there that you can outsource your product. And you can ask the supplier just to give you a prototype sample in just less than one month and sell that product 
in Amazon.com. Amazon is a great distribution platform that you can utilize. So you can still focus on two to five products if you want to sell a physical product. So make sure that you identify your niche. So for example, if you are in this tone your muscle, your stomach muscle niche, then you can have this one-on-one -on -one coaching about how you can tone your muscle. You can also combine this with physical product. Let's say you can have this equipment, how to tone your customer's stomach muscle. Or you can have this nutritional drink that you can sell in Amazon as your distribution network. So there are several ways that can help you multiply your profit each month, provided that you've got this proper planning in the beginning. You have identified your niche, long-term value, and the strategies. So just focus two to five products on your business and you're good to generate this income per month. So now let's talk about the second learning outcome that you will get here is to learn how to get out on your way to build your own irresistible marketing funnel to understand each specific needs of your customers and deliver excellence every time. So let me just erase this first and I will show you how you can structure your online business platform. So you can generate the right traffic, you can have the right capture mechanism in order for you to attract the right customer to your business, okay? So you can easily generate traffic to your business, but the most important here is you should convert this traffic into sales. So let me just uh, erase this first. Okay, so here you should understand the foundation of your business online. First is you must have the product that you want to sell here. You need traffic to see your product. Okay, so whatever product that you have here. Now, before you direct this traffic to your product that you want to sell, you need to have first your own capture mechanism. Okay, so this capture mechanism is your landing page or squeeze page, whatever you want to call it, before you drive traffic to your product. So what is squeeze page? A squeeze page, this is where you can collect the email address of your target customer. Because if let's say you are selling this equipment on how to tone your stomach muscle, or let's say you have this digital product on how they can do their exercise to tone their muscle, then you need to attract those customers who are looking, specifically looking for the equipment or for the exercises on how to tone their stomach muscle. So when you started paying your ads here, you will get the right customers here. So you need to have this quiz page. This is your landing page, okay? So make sure that you have this quiz page where you can collect the contact details of your customer. So whether this is the name, the email address, the telephone number, and once you already have this landing page, this is where you will start building your customer database. So this is your email list, okay? So email list. If let's say this customer didn't buy this product one here, let's say your product one is your healthy drink. So let me just put an arrow here. And then your product two, let's say this is your training video on how you can tone your stomach muscle. And then you have another product here that is related to your niche. Let's say this one, it's about the best recipe, how you can lower your stomach fats. So this email list, this is where you can build your relationship. If they didn't buy your first product here, you can send them to your second product. And if they didn't buy and resonate with your second product, you can send them to your third product. So this is very crucial in doing your marketing. You need to maintain retain, and engage your mailing list. Without this, it is very difficult for you to spend your advertising dollar here if you cannot convert this traffic into sales. So you need to have this email autoresponder service provider where you can build your own mailing list here before you send them to any product that you are selling here. So is this make sense? Now, there are a lot of things that are going on here. Okay, 
then you should know what kind of language, subject, message, or time of the day that you need to send your email. So you need to do your split testing to see which message is effective for this email marketing. And there are also a lot of things going on here on how you do your landing page split testing and see which landing pages, headline, color of landing pages that converts for you. So one of the major reasons why small businesses closing down is because they are pumping a lot of money here on advertising without the full understanding of what is marketing is all about and what is going on here when you do your follow-up with your target customers. So if you cannot make money from this product, either from product one, product two, product three, so it doesn't matter what you're selling here and you keep on pumping, driving traffic to your product here without seeing any results of your investment here, then in no time, your business will close down. So you need to understand the whole mechanism on how you can run your business effectively and efficiently. Because once you already have the statistics or your data and you can already predict which landing page that works best for you, that gives you conversions, then that's the time you can scale up and leverage your business. And that's where outcome number three will come into play. So here you will discover the three different pillars of traffic, how to use them to get the best out of it to increase your revenue and propel your business profits each month. So here are the three pillars of traffic, fast traffic, strategic traffic, and perpetual traffic. So let me show you some examples of fast traffic. So solo ads, display media, social media traffic, influencer media, and for strategic traffic, such as PPC, CPA traffic media, and for perpetual traffic, like video traffic or content traffic. So let's talk about solo ads. Solo ads are email-based advertisement that you can buy from other email list owners. This solo ad provider sent dedicated emails and the entire message is all about your promotion. So you buy solo ads based on how many clicks your email promotion will get or by how many subscribers your email message will be sent to. Most business owners don't normally use this. They typically work for affiliates and digital product marketers. Okay, next, let's talk about display media. Display media are display ads that you can drive potential customers directly to what you want them to see. Now, there are several ways to purchase display media. Either you can buy from networks that control ad space across a large number of publishers or websites. Ad agencies or business owner like you and me can buy directly from these networks. Display advertising is not for every business, but you can get better results using this display media and much greater exposure when properly executed. So display media are not for searchers who are looking for something online. Instead, display ads are shown onto the informational sites like CNN.com, Huffington Post, Newsweek, or Weather.com, or even in ExchangeRate.com. So with the hopes that the users will get distracted from their current activity and click your display ad. So let me show you some example of display ads. So this is an example of display ad. So you will see here, ad choices. And sometimes when you go down here, it will look like it's part of this information site. So let me pull out one example here. So you will see this banner, this is ad choice. So you will see here also, like this one, this is a display ad. It looks like it's part of the news from this inquirer.net. Display media advertising is a great way for business owners who wants to generate brand exposure online as well as to increase your website traffic. Next, under fast traffic, we have the social media traffic. Social media traffic is when you build and engage your traffic using social media sites like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. This is where you make your content 
easily shareable. And this is also where you want your readers to share your content for you to improve visibility, generate more leads or sales, strengthen your brand awareness, and to connect with your direct audience. So social media traffic is the best way to build your following. And the key to building followers is consistency. So keeping your publishing schedule is crucial to the effectiveness of your social media traffic. And know exactly what's engaging your followers. So you should experiment with different types of content. What is driving the most comments, clicks, impressions, and shares. Okay, next, under fast traffic, is the influencer media. Influencer media is something like an endorser. An influencer is normally a user on social media who has already established credibility, knowledge, and authority in a specific niche or industry. An influencer has the power to persuade his or her audience to affect the purchase decisions using his or her relationship with them. There are several types of influencer media, such as celebrities, bloggers or content creators, video creator, journalists, and leaders. Now, how these influencers promote your product, your brand, or your services? Influencers use their own channels. They will communicate with their audience about the message that you want an influencer to relate to their audience. So if you pick an influencer like doing videos, then this influencer will create a video related to your services or product. Is influencer marketing worth to use? There are several pros and cons using influencer. I guess it's better to read the guidelines that Google or the other private influencer media space. What is their rules and regulations before jumping into this influencer media. So now let's talk about the second pillars of traffic, the strategic traffic. Strategic traffic means you put some strategy behind your ad campaign so you can attract the right customers that is suited to what product or services that you are offering. So there's two types of strategic traffic, which is the PPC and CPA traffic media. PPC means pay-per-click and CPA means cost per action. So now let's talk about PPC or pay-per-click. PPC is one type of online marketing where advertisers pay a fee each time a user clicks their ad. This pay-per-click advertising is popular for search engines. So let me show you how this PPC works. So if let's say a user go to Google or any search engine like Bing, Yahoo, and they type here their query. So let's say our query here is, I am looking for how to tone my stomach muscles. Now, if let's say you are running this PPC ad campaign with Google AdWords and you have this keyword phrase, how to tone my stomach muscles inside your Google AdWords account, then most likely that your ad campaign will show on the very top of Google search engine results page. So this one is the first page. So you will see here there's no PPC ad campaign. So if you are strategic enough how you position your PPC ad campaign, then you can be on the very top of Google search engine results page. So let me just uh, go and look for another product here so I can show you some examples of PPC ad. So let's say, uh, let's look for, let's say we are looking for office table and chairs, let's say in New York, okay? New York City. So let's just assume that this user is typing this Query, office table, and chair in New York City. So you will see here, these are some examples of PPC ad campaign. So this one you will see ad. This one is also another ad. So you will see here, office chairs, New York City. So more likely that I will click this ad because it is more specific to what I am looking for. This one is also one example of PPC ad. And when you scroll down, you will see also some PPC ad below. 
So this is PPC ad. So you will see here ad. This one is PPC ad and this one is PPC ad. So there are several benefits that you can get doing this PPC advertising. You can be laser targeted to reach your potential customers who are looking exactly that will contribute to your business goals. Any type of conversion goal can easily be tracked. These goals can be ranged from lead generations, brand exposures, and sales. It will show how your campaigns are performing and what kind of traffic and results they are driving for your business. So PPC advertising has proven to be a reliable and top traffic sources seeking for quality traffic and higher chance of conversions to any kind of business goals. So now let's talk about the next strategic traffic, which is the CPA traffic media. CPA stands for cost per action. This is used by almost all big companies in order to generate leads for their product. This marketing is done by affiliates who work through their own channels in order to send traffic to advertisers' website. So this job is outsourced by the advertisers of these companies to any affiliate platforms who can serve their business objective. And these affiliates get paid in commission depending on the quality of lead generation that they can provide. So let me show you some companies who are using this CPA traffic media. So if in case, if you become more bigger and you have more budget to do this, so this is one strategic traffic that you can use. So let me show you how this CPA traffic media works. So let me just pull this out for you. So let's say this company, McDonald's, they have this 1,000 gift card exclusive that they want to promote. So they have this payout of $1.60 for every affiliate who wants to promote this campaign. So these affiliates, either they have their websites, they are a blogger, or whatever channels they are using to promote this, so they will get paid from McDonald's of $1.60 for every lead that they will get for McDonald's. So if someone entered their email address here using their affiliate link, then they will get paid. So there are a lot of companies, big companies, who are using this CPA traffic media. So another example here, like from Walmart, get a $100 Walmart gift card. So this one is also email submit. So their payout is $2 per lead. So you will see here, if someone answered these three questions for Walmart, then Walmart will pay their affiliates $2 per lead. Another big company here, like Disney, so they pay their affiliates $1.60 for every lead generation that this affiliate can give them. So this one, this is their landing page. So you can see here, this is where they can capture the email address of their target customer. So their affiliate get paid if someone fill out this survey form for Disney. So that's why let's go back here. This is very important. If you set up this landing page where you can capture the contact details of your target customers when you are starting structuring your business framework here. So just think of this. If you have some budget to run your advertising to pump a lot of traffic here, you can do that to scale up your business fast if you have that money, right? But the problem here is you need to know how you can structure your business framework the right way. What is your strategy? Here, when you are capturing your target customers, and what is your strategy over here on how you can engage your customer to get the results, the conversion that you want for you to make money here. So this one, whether you are selling hamburger, cruising, furnitures, properties, insurance, or your own book, it doesn't matter. What matters most is your strategy here, your business planning from the very start your long-term value, and your strategies. And once you structure this, you can scale up your business fast by using these three pillars of traffic. Either you will use fast traffic, strategic traffic, or this perpetual traffic. So now let me ask you, 
earning $50,000 or $100,000 or building your business empire into a million dollar? Is this doable or not? Yes, it is because you can do everything what these big companies are doing. So the principle is the same. They are also building their own customer database. Like here for Disney, they have this landing page where they can capture the contact email of their target customers. So here's what Disney will do. If you are already part of their mailing list, their customer database here, then you will receive some different emails from Disney. Like maybe they have their special price for Hong Kong Disneyland or Disney Cruising. So whatever they have here that they think is suited to what you need. So remember, when you sign up, to this landing page, they already know what drives you to put your email address here in exchange of what you need from them. So this could be, let's say you are traveling to go to Disneyland Orlando and you are looking for a place to stay there in Disney World. Or let's say you are looking for discount coupon if you are planning to go to Disney Paris. So this is exactly what you need to apply for your own business. You should know what exactly that your target customers wants from you. What do they need and how you can help them. Next, let's talk about the number three pillars of traffic, which is the perpetual traffic. Perpetual traffic means occurring repeatedly traffic. So this means a never-ending traffic. So if you have your own business website and you have content on that website, then people will keep on going back to your website. Or maybe you have your YouTube channel, so your perpetual traffic will keep on coming back or will continue to occur as long as you didn't pull down this website or this video channel. So these are the two examples of perpetual traffic. If let's say you have your YouTube channel up and running or you have a website, that is full of content about your business or services that is up and running. Now, there are several reasons why most businesses fail, and one of them is because of lack of understanding between marketing and advertising. Now, how do you know when you've done a good job at marketing your product or business? If your marketing is successful, then your revenue should grow consistently. If you have more customers, more repeat buyers, and more and more customers continue to spend their money each time they come in to your business here, then this is how you can tremendously increase your revenues. Basically, you will bring more money into your business door if you manage your strategy well here. If you don't manage this well, you might have brought in a lot of customers here, a lot of traffic and spending a lot of money in advertising, but you continue to struggle to convert this traffic into money. And another reason is failure to clearly define and understand your market, your customers, and your customers' buying habit. Small business owners normally trying to cater everyone. Spreading your services or products to many variants diminishes the quality of your services product, or meeting the needs of your customers. The market pays excellent rewards for excellent results. So if you are giving average results to your customers, then you will get average reward to your business. And another reason why small businesses fail is believing that they can do everything. One of the biggest challenge for entrepreneurs is to let go of the belief that you must have hand-on control of all aspects of your business. It's so dangerous to assume that what you have done before or in the past will still always work now and in the future. You need to accept the fast-changing new technology. What is your competition doing differently? You should be open to new ideas and you need to experiment. So let's go back here to our whiteboard. So there are several reasons and factors why small businesses fail on their journey in achieving their business goal here. Running a business, not only that you should have sufficient money 
to sustain your business. But it requires the right knowledge, the right planning from the start, because success in business is never automatic. Okay? So you have to remember this. Never automatic. So you should not strictly depend on luck. So there are several factors that you need to consider. That includes your right planning from the very start, your long-term value, your strategies, and choosing the right industry that you are passionate about. There will always be a risk and a chance of success is always slim because most business owners, when they start their journey here in building their business, they get exhausted here or maybe somewhere here because of the failure to act when they see something that are not working for their business. So they don't normally react if they see no growth in their business, even if they already spending tons of money in marketing. They don't react if they see low sales. They fail to adjust their planning and make changes. Also, many small business owners assume that when they own their own business, they will be able to work less and take more time relaxing. Unfortunately, the opposite is true. When you run your own business, you will work more longer, especially during your startup stage here. Generally speaking, it usually takes at least three to four years, okay? So let me just write here, three to four years to develop a profitable business. Your first year goal is usually earning back your investment. And the good news, nowadays, you don't need to wait for three to four years to develop a profitable business because there's no need for you to invest to any manufacturing facilities. You can simply outsource your product from China suppliers if you intend to sell a physical product. But if your intention is to sell digital products, then you can develop your business to be profitable in the span of one year. Even though most business owners would like to increase their revenues, only a small percentage actually do it. In order for the business to succeed, you must be able to weigh what is working for you and not working for your business and make a prompt decision. So there's always a risk of a business failure or less than expected return of investment. So if that happened to you, you can't blame it to someone else. Now, if you want to improve your business revenue and propel your profits, here's how we can help. So we can help you to be more secure in what you do. We offer a four-week money-back guarantee, okay? So four-week money-back guarantee. So let me just uh, write it down here. So let me make it, make this bigger. So four, week money back guarantee so you must think we are a good fit to work for you or we'll give you full prompt refund no question asked and next is we are here to listen we cannot guess what exactly you want if you already get some insights from this online training today and get stuck and cannot analyze the feasibility of your ideas we are here to listen and help you. And next, all you need is just click the below button, okay? Just click the button below to schedule your free consultation. So here's what to expect. Once you schedule a free consultation with us, you will receive an email from us to confirm this consultation appointment. Then expect a call from me or from any of our team. And this call will last for 15 to 30 minutes depending on your business issues. So this call is more of what your business issue and what you would like to do to improve your situation. So there's no string attached. There's no credit card needed. But please understand that we all have different priorities. So this is only for business owners not for affiliates or total beginners. So this is not for people who are not willing to invest for their business. So again, this is for business owners who are already spending money on advertising 
without understanding the big picture of marketing. This is for consultant or if you are doing this one-on-one -on -one coaching, thinking that effective marketing is expensive. Or if you are a product owner who are struggling to generate traffic or leads to buy your product. And for real estate or insurance broker, is struggling to find your high ticket clients. So all you need is just click the button below if you are truly serious to rise your income each month if this is your goal here and propel your profits. So just click the button below this video to schedule your free consultation. So that's all for now and thank you for your time and I do really appreciate you. Jankua here, your breakthrough guide to design your future. Thank you.